not very good on the road. When you look at how they lost to the Patriots those two times, kind of like you were saying, do you think the Cushing absence was a big deal? Even though injuries are always the same, everybody has You're going to blame the loss on Cushing? Absolutely not. Oh, okay. I'm asking you. How do you no, I heard that? you say Cushing. You did yeah. say Cushing? I did say Cushing. Oh, okay. I, I was wondering, that was you that just said it. Yeah, that good. was you. It was Cushing. When you look at their front seven, Houston, because we've talked to you during the year about J.J. Watt, do you think their front seven is good, or is he good in Houston? Is Brady James included in their front seven? It sure is. It makes it slow. Their whole crop of inside linebackers. Their front seven leaves something to be desired, big time. Brooks Weed and Connor Barron had them a breakout year last year, but they pretty well disappeared. And Antonio Smith is a highly active, you know, high energy guy. They just need to coordinate it because whenever you double watch, it seemed like the whole line went away if he wasn't going to make a play. But it was a quarterback that was more of the reason why I would say they didn't win that play than it would be on that defense. Two outside linebackers. Any reason why you think they weren't successful in Wade's defense one year to the next? Because they were successful, like you said, the year before. You know what happens, right? People Teams say, okay, put a check on him. <laughs> let, let, let's put an eye on him, check. You get a check now when you play well in this league. Now you got to play against a plane. More about them being young. They, they, they reacted to them this year. Now they need to react to how they reacted to them the following year. Maybe they did what some of us do in this league after we have a little success. Say we got it. <laughs> they know train is hard in the offseason. You know, have a little honey do is a different that. I think get some room, my man. I think every most people look at these two teams here, big physical teams. Do you think that's what Houston is not? Huh? Do you think Houston doesn't have what these teams have? Big physical, they'll push you around, they'll stand up for themselves. Do you think that's anything going on with that team? That they're not that type of team. Say it one more time the question that you're asking me. Do you think Houston's a physical enough team or a, Do I think physical or Houston's physical enough? enough? Yeah. What they run for 150 yards a game? Sometimes. You gotta be physical to run the ball, right? Mm -hmm. So the what last they had was a quarterback, a quarterback that's a big game turd. That's, that's what it. they had. That's it. That's it. And that, do you think the rest of the league thinks the same thing? Rest of, rest, I mean, look at his, look at his numbers in big game, boss. You, you work down there, right? Yep. Go look at his numbers in the big game. Well, I, I when your quarterback throws the ball to the guy on the first play, second play, play, hit him right square in the hands, he drops it. In the next pass, he didn't even think about throwing it to Andre. I mean, he... I mean, what? Come on, man. You gotta do what Flacco did. You gotta go on the road, you gotta make those throws. You gotta go do what Eli did. Go on the road, you gotta make those throws. Y'all quarterback ain't ready to make those throws.